I'd like to be cocky and confident in telling you guys that I'm going to ace this challenge and not laughing with these Tom Segura clips, but I'm not confident. I'm, I've seen some of his stuff, and he's pretty hilarious. I doubt that I'll be able to make it through it, but I'm up for the challenge. Let's get into it. What's going on, you guys? My name is Polo. Before we get into it, please like the video, subscribe, and hit that notification bell if you like this type of content on my page. Um, liking the video is a good way of letting me know that and to do more content like this. All right, so also check out my Patreon below. There's content on my Patreon that doesn't make YouTube. You know, for whatever reason, sometimes my content, I upload it and it gets blocked. So that will go on my Patreon. So by checking out my Patreon, You'll get to see content that is not on YouTube. Also, I respond to all messages on my Patreon. So a lot of the requests that you see me react to are from Patreon messages. So let's go ahead and get into this video. What's the deal with airplane peanuts? <sighs> you get big loads. <laughs> <laughs> what? Bro? Oh, I missed it. <laughs> What's the deal with airplane peanuts? You shoot big loads. Oh. <laughs> what, bro? Do you shoot ropes? Like, what do you got? What, dude? Is it like, small quantity? You're not like a dribbler, are you? No, I mean, dude, I ain't no fucking Pete Maravich. You know what I'm saying? I shoot right? fucking loads. Whoa, really? I'll Guy. show you. I'll show no, you. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's line up. <laughs> if we stood at the fucking end of this table, uh -huh. and, you, and I'm backed up even a couple days, I'm. I mean, I'm getting distance on this table. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Wow, I'm, that's incredible. Wow. Yeah. I mean, and yeah. also, like, you know how you you have like pumps, right? Like an orgasm is like, it's like your your dick goes like, dum, dum, yeah, dum, right. How many do you go through? You think? Like, count them out in your head. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Six, seven, <laughs> eight, maybe. Yeah. See, <laughs> that fucking quick. <laughs> I knew I was going to fail. Oh, so bad. I, I, I knew I wasn't going to be able to do it. <laughs> right? Like an orgasm is like, it's like your your dick goes like, dum, dum, yeah. Dum. Right? How many do you go through? You think? <laughs> like count them out in your head. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, maybe. Yeah. The last two are weak, weak, weak. Though mm -hmm. you got to be in my body to feel them. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm like on a bad day, twelve, thirteen. On a on a really strong. I think game, I'm around twelve. Up to like sixteen. Yeah. Oh my god, man! I went to a doctor about it. <laughs> That's crazy. You know what he told me? What? You're lucky. Right. <laughs> You're a lucky guy. Shut up. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. <laughs> yeah. Damn, bro. I bust nuts, dog. That's crazy. I mean, I bust them too. I bust probably, you know, good, pretty good nuts, but I don't do. I don't think I'm, you know, I'm gonna win anything. Now, okay, here's what I'm here's here's what I'm struggling with. So I've been sushi shamed. We both have many times, so many times by both chefs and servers, where they're like, "That's too much food," and I'm being polite by not doing their accent. Sushi shamed. <laughs> so they'll say like, "That's enough." Just do the accent. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so horrible, yeah <laughs> what the accent is crazy. Hold on, man. <laughs> So they, oh my god. They've actually been like, don't order this and that. And I'm like, all right. And then like, you know, start like and are you still hungry? Yeah. Okay, then, I'll play then. you. I'll play you play the guy. Okay. Like, Cause I don't know what you're saying. Okay. okay. Excuse me, Ching Chong. Um <laughs> Hey, hey. Ching Chong. Hey. Nobody <laughs> says that. Nobody. Ching Chong. Ching Chong. Yeah, yeah. Um, hey, Ching um, Chong. Ching Chong. Ching Chong. Should, should, should I get to number three, the boat? You know what I mean? The boat with all the sushi on it? How many friends come with you? <laughs> <laughs> what did you even say? I knew I wasn't going to make it through the podcast. 
I knew I wasn't going to make it through the podcast. I'm sorry, you guys. I knew I wasn't going to. Do it. <laughs> I've ever heard my life. What are you talking we about? We gotta get out of here. That was dead on. Oh, man, that was fucking that crazy. Was dead good. on. Do it so again. Racist. Do it again. Yeah, yeah. I might find comedy. <laughs> Hi everyone. Just wanted to get on here to tell y'all that I think I'm leaving TikTok. No. no. Oh no. I've enjoyed all the friendships. And Thanks for turning the volume up. Background. Some dramas going on. That I no, really, don't leave. really. Cool I didn't video. even know you were allowed to be on. I don't even have one. I didn't know you were allowed to be on it if you were over nineteen. <laughs> like, I had no idea that there were sixty-year-olds leaving TikTok. Oh, there are. <laughs> like, like, emotionally making an announcement. You're like emotionally going. I have made a lot of friendships here. It's like that's illegal. What? That's that's against the law. What do you mean you've made a lot of friendships here? Right. What are you talking about? I mean, we had been yeah. day drinking when, in Florida. Yeah, I definitely need to create a TikTok family. <laughs> And we saw these little kids, like fifth graders, yeah, um, <laughs> by the pool in this place. And uh, we walked in on them. And they were choreographed. And we we're like, what are you doing? And we've been drinking. Right. And they're like, oh. And they're in their school uniforms. They're like, we're right. making a TikTok. And we both were like, we're on TikTok. And, and uh, they were like, oh, OK. These are like 10, 11-year-old girls. And they think girls. they're going to get kidnapped. And then they're like, what's your handle? And I was like, I spelled it out for them. And then as we walked out, I realized that the last one I had posted <laughs> was me pulling my nipples and going like, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, we got to go. We got to go. We got to get out of here. <laughs> you know? He fucking did a lot of creepy things down there, man. Uh, rest in peace, you know? He was good to me. <laughs> Yeah, he was a creepy he fuck. He was living though. with his brother. If he he's, <laughs> poor guy. He said that at the memorial service, I would die. <laughs> 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 he did a lot of creepy things. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. He's a real piece of shit. Rest in peace. <laughs> I, never, I never could tell if his hair was his. Rest in peace. Doc, don't you ever, you ever go to a funeral? And the guy's talking, like, they give him a memorial. In the back, you hear, you're like, this is such a bullshit. Last time oh, I saw yeah. this guy, was doing blow yeah. off a stripper's ankle. Yeah. <laughs> and this kid, he's a loving father, sure. Uh, yeah. You should have seen him that uh, night. Funerals are some of the fakest things ever. But I guess it's a place, of, it's how, oh, how you look at it. It could be just people only want to say positive things about the person. Uh, even though there may be a lot of negative things, that's just not the things that they highlight at that time. How much you love this kid? When he had his Personally, I don't do funerals. Tongue up that fucking yams <laughs> fucking asshole with coke on it. <laughs> so wait, does ching chong really not mean anything? I think ching chong means um, um, hello. Maybe can I don't we know. can we just address something about it though? Go ahead. It's it's a fun thing to say. Yeah, it's, like, it's unfortunate that it has negative, you know, racial yeah. connotation because it really, it really feels. It flows off the tongue. It flows like, off the tell tongue. Me, t- tell me, you guys have seen. Funny, I never say it. <laughs> there is a very offensive meme. Okay, it's it's a mentally handicapped Asian guy, and he's a maestro of an orchestra. I know exactly what you're talking about. And it says, and a one, and a three, and a ching chong potato. Yeah, and it's. Easily the funniest meme I've ever seen in my entire life. Yeah, world. right. Is it offensive? Yeah. Yeah. Is it, It's just very funny. Very funny. But also, like, it also, it would be nice if it was acceptable <laughs> to use for, like, you know what I mean? Like, let's say you were like, hey, uh, you know, my, my mom made this dish. And I was like, what is it? And then you could be like, it's just some ching chong shit, you know? <laughs> and like, oh, you know what? On oh, second thought, maybe I do use it. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I got Line drunk with what's the the old the guy that was running Houston Improv the Iggy La La that, that no, guy no, no not not a uh, Trey no, no the no. creepy guy the no. creepy guy <laughs> yeah 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 he's a creepy no, fuck no the creepy guy's dead the other guy no no no, no. he's a creepy <laughs> fuck they they sent him to Arlington he's the rapist he's the tree oh, jumper geez, I wasn't saying yeah anything. yeah they put him they put him in they put him in Arlington. <laughs> You know, Dan Murr was a fucking dirty coke fiend. <laughs> <laughs> like, a, like a filthy coke fiend. And he he would get so coked up that you think he had a stroke. His oh. lip would turn, like his lip would just oh. go upwards. Wow. So one night, everybody for years, one night when I had the really bad sleep apnea, and I really wasn't sleeping, and I didn't know what, uh, I didn't know what the... <laughs> <God damn it. laughs> 
Uh, yeah, I didn't know what the sleep apnea, what the effects were yet. Uh-huh. I passed out one night really hard, and all of a sudden I wake up to the door banging, and it's Joe Rogan pre-marijuana when he was fucking miserable. <laughs> I always say he was an ape. You ever see the evolution of an uh-huh. ape? That's when he was an ape. Yeah. If your parent doesn't know that you're smoking meth and you're out in the streets and you're doing stuff, that's on them, man. They should have had uh, an eye on you. So yeah. It's not your responsibility. Who yeah. the yeah. would you suck? Like, how oh do you? God. Oh my uh, God! You I mean, let it go. Well, I'm gonna go well, into the no, dick I sucks. Know, I want to know. First of all, are <laughs> you? Let Bobby off the hook with the dick sucks already. You, all right, that just came out of nowhere. Naturally good at it because I oh feel like. God. Oh my God! No, I Tom. feel like. I feel like. Like, yeah. as a guy, you're like, <sighs> I know what I like. So you have, like, certain skills, right? That's, well, That's silly. I just want to say this to you, and yeah. I'm not going to go into detail about it. Okay. But when you're young, you don't know what you like. Yeah. So I think it was pretty much amateur hour. Okay. You know what I mean? I would probably, like... I wouldn't go down to the sack or the taint, yeah, yeah. right, and go, you like that? <laughs> right. right. I think it was more like, you know, <laughs> licking the tip and going, you know, you know, does that suffice? Right. <laughs> what? It's just <laughs> funny to think. <laughs> 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 yeah. Does that yeah. feel good? Yeah. Like, if I was... <laughs> <laughs> but if, look how happy my yeah, husband yeah, is. Yeah, He's yeah, never yeah, this yeah, joyful. Yeah. Yeah. Right. If I was never a gay man, yeah. and I was, and you were gay, uh-huh. and you and I were having sexual al- sexualities with oh. each other, uh-huh. you and I would probably be like, um, we probably know what we we liked, you know. Of course. And we would do extra things, yeah. you know, yeah. to, pl- to to please ourselves. Sure. I would sure. like to please you. Thanks. This makes me mad uncomfortable, yo. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. I like yeah. that. But yeah, he was a kid, babe. Kids, oh, yeah, babe. kids don't know how to give blowjobs, <laughs> yeah, in case you're wondering. Yeah. I mean, is yeah. that yeah. Yeah. an answer for you? And were you yeah. blowing adults? Or, or no, 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 no. Oh, no. My, oh my God. You can't let it go, can you? I mean, it's just like... You can't let it go, can you? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Who is it? <laughs> and this is your... Sounds problem. personal. Do you like that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's your, it's your oh fault. Oh, my goodness. So check this out. This guy yeah. smoked meth <laughs> with his brother. Uh, something cool happened. What? <laughs> my brother didn't believe me. But when he smoked with me, he put out his dick. I couldn't believe how big his dick was. He jacked off in four strokes and shot the most cum he'd ever shot. In his life. He's 49, and he's fine. He has no neuropathy problems at all. Yeah. Yeah, his dick gets even harder and thicker and even more cum. He believes me now. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty good ad for meth. Right? Yeah. yeah. And I was like, I want to take a truck stop shower too. You know, I want to. <laughs> no. I want to get it. Yeah, but wanna... don't you run the risk of getting stabbed? That made me, that made me nauseous. I'm sorry. That made me a little nauseous. Oh my goodness. You, you also run by the like risk, drifters so. and. You also could like meet a cool guy. A cool lotless. Yeah. <laughs> well, then the truck stop shower conversation led to. What else happens at truck stops? Right, good I things. Was like, I, was like, <laughs> I was like, "Hey, you, are there a really?" He's like, "Lot lizards." What? <laughs> and I go, "What?" <laughs> I, I go, like this. I like the phrase <laughs> lot, lot, lizards. "lot lizards." He's like, "Oh yeah, they're there." Uh, <laughs> I go, "What happens?" He goes, they knock on your door. <laughs> they knock on your door. They'll just come up, sneak through the. the the lot yeah. lizard. <laughs> and then, you know, they, they ask if you want some. And I go, are they everywhere? And he goes, not everywhere. He's like, California sure has a few. The nice yeah. weather, yeah. <laughs> the lot lizards aren't afraid. And then sometimes it's a different arrangement. <laughs> sometimes he said, like, you'll know, like, the driver mm. will, like, obviously, mm. re- like, knows someone in the area. You'll see, like, cars pulling in that they're Clearly, it's been arranged, like maybe arranged beforehand. You mean? Yeah, like the guy knows that this girl works in this area. This lizard. So the lizard will show up, <laughs> and then uh, have. The, I was like, "Oh, what's that like?" He's like, "I don't know." About <laughs> yeah, <that."> sure. <laughs> he so, doesn't know. Right. I'm like, you. He's know. like Deb. I don't know what's you a lot know lizard. about these lot lizards. And I don't like, know. Yeah. I'm so innocent. Uh, I'm anyways. just a dummy. <laughs> yeah, I, I wouldn't be in a lot lizard. But I would. I I would like. I mean, I think a fun fantasy. Uh, would be like a stranded girl, you know, uh-huh. who's like, okay, moving I along. I don't have any way to get to. My <laughs> <laughs> I already know I, where this is I going. Don't know Dirty how John, to get to, Dirty Tom, to Dallas. I'm stuck here. I'm like, oh, I'm going to Dallas. <laughs> or, <laughs> yeah, come on over. And then she gets on the bus. I'm like, now you got to pay the toll, you know. And like then, an old porn movie. Like what you do is. 
<laughs> He's really encouraging you, uh, Blue Bear right you, uh, now. You you just wear her out, and you know, and wear bus. her out. What do you mean, <laughs> babe? You know, and the bang bus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The bang well, bus. You told me you guys <laughs> take your turns on the lot. That's what it? I'm saying. Well, I'm yeah. saying with this stranded girl. Yeah. As like she she's gets back on the, the stranded girl. Uh -huh. I give it to my stranded girl. <laughs> I give it to the opening act. He runs through her, mm -hmm. then the driver takes it, his turn, uh -huh. and then we drop her off nowhere close to Dallas. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that sounds like a savage. Like, Where savage. is this? And I'm like Montana. Good luck. Yeah. Yeah. You shouldn't hitchhike, you stupid bitch. There, you, I wasn't gonna it. go that far. We waited three hours for you to <laughs> arrive, but that's too far. And and we would have waited forever because I am you sorry. Are I already the, apologized. I'm you, sorry. You are the Thomas, Sir Thomas, Sir Thomas. Okay, and we know. Um, hey, I'll tell you this. What? This is a this because this is actually just more wholesome than the only other time that I completely forgot I was scheduled to do a podcast. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So this is the second time. Today, I was at a big tennis match. You know, I was out in the sun. I got home, showered, laying on the couch. Literally, Andrew's like, let me know when you get there. And I was like, fuck. <laughs> right? And I just panicked. Yeah. Got my kid dressed. And I was like, yeah, you guys got to watch them. And I just jumped in the car. And the last time was in 20, God, I want to say this is 2012. Holy shit. But I remember it like it was yesterday. And I had agreed to do the Sklar Brothers podcast. Which is one of the best. They're great. I haven't they're seen great it. guys. And they're like, hey, will you, uh, you know, come on, on Friday and we'll see you at, at, at noon? And I go, yeah, okay. I'm jerking off, looking at my phone, <laughs> watching yeah. porn, like stroking my dick. And it yeah, just, yeah. you know, the, the, the iPhone thing drops. <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. like Randy Sklar. And I'm yeah. like, and, and as soon as I see his name, I'm like, fuck. <laughs> so he's like, are you close? And I was like, to coming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, you okay, okay. <laughs> now, the fact that she can speak clearly means there's nothing in her mouth. Huh? So I'm going to go with not dick sucks. Originally, I thought dick sucks. Obvi. So it's not a dick suck. I'm thinking she said there's a fist and a cock. You got Yeah, good, good at ear. Thank you. I'm going to go with she's got a fist in her b-hole and a cock in her v-hole. Wow. Uh, Nadav, can you weigh in? Yeah, I'll say, Christina, you're really close. Uh, there is a fist in the V-hole, uh, <laughs> and there's nothing in the B-hole. <laughs> he sounds kind of bummed out about it. Wow. There's <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so bummed out? Yeah, what's out? the problem? Well, I got a text last night <laughs> at around 9. I was getting ready for bed. Because, <laughs> you know, we have early call times on show days. Yeah, and? And Tom just sends me very vague links to <laughs> heavyr.com <laughs> that are just category links. Yeah. And he's like, hey, go into here, <laughs> find stuff that sounds funny, looks funny, and prep it for tomorrow. And it's like, I'm supposed to be in the studio in 12 hours, and Tom just assigned me half a day's worth of work. Yeah. And did you stay up till 2 in the morning? No. I told him, hey, can we push this to maybe next week? He's like... Get at least a couple. Oh, my God. Okay. Ah, you're so, where did you find this website? Well, here's the thing. That's a really cool story. Go ahead. <laughs> I have learned what the R stands for in heavyr.com. You don't have to share it. <laughs> um, What's R? No, no, no. Because so, they ruled out. I've seen that website. I can't stay on that website. That site is crazy. A lot of the clips that I thought would have been fun, but. I just learned it after you told me. Don't worry about it. Who was one of the you most unique people that ever came out to see you perform, or somebody that shocked you that that was like at the show or something? Yeah. Hmm. I'm trying to think, man. I'm trying to think of a good one too. I don't have an answer really, but did Tyson ever come to one of your shows? Tyson came to my show in Pittsburgh. Yeah. Wow. That was that was pretty wild. I mean, Tyson Chandler. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it's, it's weird. I mean, to be like hanging out with Mike Tyson in the green room. Oh, Mike room. Tyson. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. Like, Man, there's only one Tyson when it comes to Tyson by the first name. Ow. To like and have him just like hang out and smoke cigarettes in your green, like in a green room smaller than that room, and you're just like, what's up? And like, how many white dudes would it take to jump Mike Tyson now at his age? Right Beat now, him? yeah. Depending on the type of dude. Um, what about you and me? Listen to me, man. You think that like being the way I look, I was killing it in the nineties? I mean? wasn't because imagine this. Look at this body. Yeah. You didn't have this body. Right. Okay. You didn't have you know, 
You're, why you gotta make it like that? I didn't do anything. I mean, that's what I'm thinking, but don't. Do it. <laughs> I know, but, but you don't that, have I what. You know what, that's what I'm I have. I think that you're wrong because I don't care what you you're think. You're not gonna it's believe not what this. I, thought. I know, but you're not gonna believe this. But I sincerely, from the get go, found you to found you attractive. All right. I mean, she's, I also grew up you know, around a lot so of Koreans. Funny. You did? Yeah. She's like in high school. I would have dated dude. No, you wouldn't. I dated fucking. You would have never even seen me. She said I'm out in the woods. I'm in the woods doing lunch, snorting crystal meth. You dated ugly. Oh yeah. I fucked up a ton of ugly guys because I wasn't that cute either. When I first came from the Philippines, I had a She stopped the cap. Well, then I wouldn't want you, bitch, bitches. back then. You yeah, know what I mean? I mean, poor tooth to gum ratio. It was, I was a mess. Who else could I? could have fucked hot boys. The best part of that statement yeah. is like, of course I would have dated you. I dated other ugly guys. <laughs> 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 my uh, older sister, I have an older sister and a younger sister. My older sister. Your older sister is 92. 92 years old. Wild. It's crazy. Yeah, we're born so far apart. <laughs> um, but she uh, she has been the per the, the person at fault in thirteen or fourteen car accidents. What? Yeah, take her license away. I know. That's it. What state is this in? A few, but mostly <laughs> in Wisconsin and Florida. She sounds like a nightmare. The national problem on the road. She's it's unbelievable. Well, time out. Let me ask you something. Not to cut you off. Yeah. In Wisconsin, there isn't a three strike law, so maybe that's why she. Because you know, that's where she started driving. Okay, because because I don't know if you know this. This is a, we used to joke about this in Chicago. Wisconsin has no law for, in DUI culture. If you get three DUIs, you have a license. Uh, your license is expelled for the rest of your life, right? In you, yeah. well, three strike law states: California, yeah, yeah. You know, most places that Illinois have logic, like that. Yeah, if you have three three DUIs, you're done for done. Yeah, right. Wisconsin does not have a three strike law for DUIs. There was a woman. Sorry to interject, but there was a woman. I remember reading stories. She had 12 DUIs. Yeah, I've always heard those stories. And you're but like, Wisconsin, because Wisconsin cops are like, come on, Betty, get home, will you? And she's like, all right, you get it at home. <laughs> They're like, wow, oh, shit. Gotta take you in. Come on. we got. Will you follow us? Will you follow us? Can you, like, Wisconsin has that, like, drinking... Country lifestyle like, yeah, where they're like, I she's thought fine. you were queer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we gotta take her in. You know what um, was really funny? We'll do the podcast live, your mom's house live. Yeah. And people will come up to us, and I'll be like, "How's it going? Thanks for coming." They're like, yeah, "I really like that Steep Row more." And I'll be like, "Thanks a lot, man." <laughs> <laughs> and then they'll be like, "We we, we came out kind of hoping to see that." I'm like, "We didn't advertise that." Like, you're, you're telling me how disappointed you are? Yeah. You wanted to see a different movie? Like, it's. So, wait, told you where you were be seeing? honest. When was the last time you guys 69? 69? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be honest. I know that it was. We. It's. I'm going to say six years, at least six years. No, so it's been. It's not that long. 69. Yeah, it's, it's not that long. No, it's been a while, but not, not that long. The sex position? 69, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why are you asking personal shit with his wife? <laughs> Right. <laughs> He's fucking Bert. Because we were talking about 69. Look, you were talking about 69 and earlier. But, um, that was nice. You, but the fit part you're going to really love, so they're GoPro Hero 4 Blacks. Guess what they're called? What? That one's Wesley Snipes. <laughs> that one's Kimbo Slice. Uh-huh. And that's Jameis Winston. <laughs> so He's be, so black. Dude, <laughs> Jameis Winston. Not skin tone, just behaviorally. <laughs> Jameis Winston. I can't decide whether I really fucking love the guy, like if he's a Forrest Gump of football or if uh, he is <laughs> <laughs> He's not the Forrest Gump? <laughs> have you ever witnessed uh, a surgery? Uh, no. No, have you? Many. Really? <sighs> yeah. I had the wild idea that I wanted to be a doctor, a surgeon. You did? Well, this is young though. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. So I was like a freshman in high school and I tell, I'm like, I think I want to be a doctor. I mean, I'm a freshman. Aren't your parents like, come on. Yeah, of course. But I think they're like, well, this is a good sign. It's a good sign, but also like, like, he's fucking dumb. He's not going to do it. (laughs) But I was like, yes, I do. I mean, I'm very convincing, you know? And they're like, okay. So I go, I think I want to be like a surgeon though, you know? So my dad calls his brother, who's like a well-known doctor who sets me up is your dad a doctor by the way no okay his brother and uh sets me up to go to the mayo in jacksonville and witness surgery like for a day to just be a part of it like i get there 7 a.m and i'm a, I'm a freshman i remember that the one of the doctors goes what school do you go to i was a kind of a big kid you know yeah i mean for a freshman in high school i was probably uh 
I don't know, 5'9", five, 5'10", five, and like 185 or something. Full so size. Full size. Yeah. And he was like, what school do you go to? And I, I say my high school, and he's like, that's a university? And I go, I'm in high school. And he was like, you're in high school. <laughs> so I think he thought he Did was also Did you eat the other high school boys? Well, he's like, he goes like, why are you do-? Like, he thought he was going to take like a college kid. Yeah, right, right, right. And he's like, so you're here. I was like, I want to do this. <laughs> and he was like, okay. All right. So I witnessed 13 surgeries that day. Holy fuck. They start wow. me like first thing. Like I'm at the hospital 630 in the morning. Personally, I can't watch a surgery. I can't do it. I'm extremely squeamish. Anything like that. I'm that guy that will probably faint watching a surgery. Yeah. And this guy, he's like, all right. And he takes me in like the first surgery we witness is to an 87 year old woman. Who's having a cyst removed from her vagina? Oh my God. And I go in there and he's like, You're gonna stand here. He goes, like, so I'm standing at the foot of the bed. And you standing in like a just, in the just smock stare, and all staring, shit. Just yeah. hearing it makes me squeamish. Straight oh, up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm covered and everything. And he goes, uh, he go, come here, come here. And he pulls me aside. He goes, just so you know. She's not under, so if you say something, she can hear it. Go, <laughs> she's okay. awake for the surgery? Yeah, she's just like uh, anesthetized. Ah, right, right, from below down. the waist. Yeah, yeah. Do they start and like, so there's this 87 year old pussy just like wide open in front of me. I'm like, all right. I'm That's gonna, how you knew you were I, gay. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> and then he kind of, he's like, they go in there and then he, he's like, here's the cyst. And then he's like, holy shit, like this is enormous. So they start bringing in other people to look at it. And then they go, like, Edith. And she's like, yes. He goes, we're going to take some pictures. <laughs> <laughs> and she's like, okay. We just want to post this stuff, He's man, like, on uh, MySpace. This is wild. Goes, We've never seen one this size. So this is going to be in a journal. But your face won't be in the photos or anything like that, okay? Ooh. She just gives, like, a yeah. rock on above the... Yeah, <laughs> yeah fuck yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so they start taking pictures. And I'm sitting there like, oh, my God. And then he pops it, and it's just, oh, yeah, it's just like oozing. Oh. <laughs> no, my God. And we leave that, and he was like, wasn't that something? And I go, yeah, it was. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get some stand-up comedy. <laughs> yeah. He's like, you farted this morning uh, horrendously. <laughs> this morning, <laughs> no, was it last night? We Probably were, both. We, yeah, both. Then he's going to get excited about that, too, or are you changing the subject? Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was, we, uh, we made sweet uh, marital relations. And then afterwards we were, you know, whatever, laying around. And he goes, you know, you're lucky. I go, why? He goes, well, I held in a fart for you that whole time. <laughs> yeah. And I go, wow, what a lucky gal. I, am. I feel like you. I should get credit for that. I, I think every guy has probably done that uh, my, quite a few times. Right. I feel Unless like you're a savage. I go. And I was like, nope, <laughs> like, don't do that right now. Oh, how sweet. It, yeah. Mm-hmm. I had just settled in, right. you know, and I was like. Nah, don't let this go right now. That's beautiful. Yeah, see? He can appreciate <laughs> it. It's amazing. Would I, your I get excited. Yeah. <laughs> talking about this with you guys. <laughs> would, now, would your wife be... Joe, Joe's head is about to explode. Uh, would she consider it nice, too? That you hold, Do you hold them in, or do you Yeah, I'm try, I try my best. <laughs> yeah. And if I do accidentally let one go, I'd let everybody know. Get yeah. out of the way. Get out of the way. Yeah, everybody <laughs> clear nice. out. Yeah. How can you I get out of the way? way? This sounds... I don't know if this is racist or not. I never assumed the girl was white. You, the girl that uh, that accused him? Yeah, I figured she was black. Why? I don't know. I just never thought he'd hook up with white chicks. Like, I just assumed... Well, his girlfriend, then and now, is black. He yeah. has a black girlfriend. I, I just saw him as a guy who would not be attracted to white chicks. Well, I think they, they just know that those snow bunnies are easy to get it into. Because <laughs> you know that, like, among black guys... The whole thing is that white girls are whores, right? Like that's the whole thing. No. Yeah, for sure. They're like white chicks are white chicks will will suck it, we'll put it in their ass, we'll do it. Like white girls are whores. So are they you all serious? they all just stick their dicks in them because they're like they'll just do it. Yeah. This is news to me. <laughs> I'm saying among college <laughs> athletes for sure. Really? A hundred percent. Oh, well, I guess the ones that college, like, you yeah. see the black dudes at the mall with, like those ones that are like. I I, I guess if you're thinking from a. A, a college student's perspective, yeah. Fours. <laughs> like, then maybe sure, but like, like, Leanne, fucking good luck. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Bush. <laughs> the white chicks I hang out with are whores. But if you go on a college campus and like, 
any big D1 basketball or football program, you're a black dude. Wait, like, how is, where's this research coming from? Dude, put it out there and and <laughs> and tell me that I'm wrong. It's like the bat. It's like the bat signal. <laughs> tell me that I'm wrong. <laughs> They're getting their dick sucked by. I want to fucking. I want to call. White. I want to call. I want to yeah? call one of my black friends. Really? <laughs> Find out. Yeah. Oh, please do. All he has to do is scroll down and look for a black friend. <laughs> okay. It's not a comic, is it? No, 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 no. But he's got a he's got a comic sensibility. Okay. He's uh I don't want to say who he is in case he says something horrific. Here we go. Yeah. All right, let's call him and find out. Oh, I'd love to, I want to hear this so badly. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? Um, oh, you can't say. Okay. I can say. I guess it's Omar. Omar Dorsey. He was in. Uh, he's in Eastbound and Down. Okay. He's in the. <clears throat> uh, he's the guy who I. I had come over and read the N word in my book. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, which word? The he's pounding down. That was a good series. I remember that series. He said never. really epic series. I'm trying to think of who he's talking about though. I can't think of him, but I remember that series it was phenomenal. Remind? No, <laughs> no. He said it like a white guy. <clears throat> Where is he? I love that you can't believe that someone's not answering. Where is he? Yeah, like it's well, I mean, it's, it's me. Right. Yeah, <laughs> it's me. The only person that doesn't answer when I call is you. You have reached the voicemail box of eight. Okay. All right. So, uh, yeah, he'll call back. We'll get some. Well, yeah, we'll get some some clarification on that. Oh, I know another black dude. Call the other black dude. Um, All right. What's his name? Sterling. Okay. Sterling is such a black name. You know Sterling, Sterling Sharp? Hold on, hold on. Sterling... Oh, here's Omar. Perfect timing. Oh, great. Omar. What's going on, Bert? Hey, uh, you're on the podcast. I need to ask you, I need to ask you your opinion. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm with my buddy Tom, and he was saying that that commonly known at like at like say like Florida State or like a big uh, division one school. Yeah. That that black guys' opinions of white girls is that they're they're whores and easier to fuck than black chicks. Is that true? <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I know they do your homework. <laughs> <laughs> okay, would you rather everywhere you go, you have to run to get there? I'm out on that. I don't, I don't even care what the next one is. My back can't take it. It's literally like you go to the next room in your house to say like something to your wife. No, yeah. exactly. No. It's always running. It's Never stretching. <laughs> just always running. Right. You always have to, you have to run if to somebody, Irvine. If someone knocks on your front door, you have to run there. You have to run on stage. Heavy you feet. Run. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I'm out. Yeah. I, don't, I don't care what this is. Or join ISIS. All right, ISIS. Let's get those fucking infidels. Or every time you speak, you're shouting. So you're basically a toddler. Like you're just you're full screaming, volume full shouting. Vo- like right Will now. Will it hurt my voice to do it? Of course, yes. Yeah, a little painful. bit. Yeah. Of course. It's uh, not fun. Neither of these are going to be fun. But you have to go like the phone ring. <laughs> Hello! Yeah! Like that. You, you always <laughs> you say, you say everything in that range. Yeah, and your stand-up, too. I found a loophole. <laughs> I find a loophole. What's, What's the loophole? loophole? I would just ignore people. Oh. So then I wouldn't have to talk to him, and then they, when they, I just wait till they <laughs> say my name ten times, and I'd be like, "What?" <laughs> so it makes sense. <laughs> it's a loophole. Because you need, you, 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 you yeah. need your health. Good. You need your health, and my 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 body would just hurt so much what if I did your, that. Your sweet wife, who you love, be like, "Bill, you gotta go." <laughs> yeah. And then she's like, "Do you <laughs> think you can take your daughter to the park?" You're like, "Yeah." And then your sweet daughter. Yeah, but here. I could explain to her. I have an inflection. <laughs> yeah. Ignore the tone of my voice. I love you more than life itself. <laughs> You're my best friend. So dumb. I'd love to go to the movies, <laughs> but you're going to have to do the purchase. <laughs> he can't whisper during the movie. Yeah, he yeah. can. He can shout it. He's <laughs> one of my favorite actors. Yeah, definitely. He could do it. I think the wife did it. <laughs> <laughs> you get that some more popcorn. Yeah, but I actually, because that, that would be fun. Once yeah. my wife was into it, I would just be totally quiet. <laughs> yeah. And you're know, having sex. You like that? <laughs> <laughs> you feel so good. How many friends come with you? Oh, man. That was fun. That was fun. Uh, 
I definitely need to start checking out episodes from that podcast. It looks like there's a lot of great moments in it. And um, like none of these, I, I haven't, I don't think I've, I've watched one episode of it, but I am a fan of his stand up comedy. So uh, instead of doing that, I'm, I'm glad I checked this out because I'm definitely checking out the, uh, the podcast now. Uh, but guys, if you like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That way you can stay up to date with my latest videos. Have a great day. Peace. Mm-hmm.